say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's land? It is an honor to be here today to commemorate this meaningful ceremony as we honor all of our veterans in Orange and surrounding community. They joined the military for a dedicated cause and they serve. So today, we honor all of our veterans. Well, now more than ever, as you know, we're living in unprecedented times. You know, there's a lot of doubt, fear, and uncertainty about our future. And veterans, more than any, know how to handle those types of things. And it's important for us to lead from the front and provide that leadership and guidance by being an example of fortitude, perseverance, and all of the things that our service in the military has taught us. It is estimated that we have some 72 plus thousand veterans who live here within Orange County, but many of our veterans are not aware of all of the benefits that they're entitled to because of their valiant service to our nation. So here in Orange County, we've had a Veterans Advisory Council that works to make certain that the veterans who do live here, they understand what is available to them. And so this is an opportunity for us to also say and advertise to the veterans who are here who may not yet be receiving the benefits they deserve, that there's an office here within Orange County that works daily to try to ensure that they uh, get the benefits they deserve. You can visit our website on the county's page, which is www.ocfl.net slash Veterans Advisory Council. We would love for each and everyone in this community to come and be a part of a great movement. We want to make sure that no one is left behind. No veteran will ever be left behind. No one understands a veteran like a fellow veteran. And there's a lot of times where we need to lean on each other for that support, but also we need to go out in the communities and be of service as well. The brave souls, the men and women who have served our nation in various armed forces, we enjoy the freedoms that we have as Americans because of the sacrifice that they made. And so because of that, uh, we do honor them. We don't ever want to forget uh, the service that they provide to our nation.